A large group of teens had just seen a Disney movie when they say security and police took them into custody on the plaza. And at least one parent was right outside waiting to pick them up. New at 5, Lisa Benson spoke with the teens and their parents. Well, the two 15-year-olds had just left the movie when a security guard asked them their age and a police officer escorted them off the property. I'm officially a college student. Monster University is a Disney movie about monsters becoming friends. Abby Blake and Natalie Hickey watched the movie at the Cinemark Theater on the plaza Saturday night before being taken into custody. She goes, do you know that you're in violation of the um, city ordinance? And we're like, no. And she goes, you're breaking curfew. And like, I didn't even know there was a curfew. Well, I told the first guy that my mom was there. He didn't care. Abby's mom was driving around waiting for and the girls to get out of the movie when she got a phone call from Abby who said they were being taken away by police. And the whole time, I have no idea who has them. Is it really police? Who has them? The girls say Highland Property Security Guards and Kansas City Police Officers escorted them across the street and around the corner to the security office where they were put in a holding area. That's where Dina shot this video as she waited for her daughter, who said she'd been searched for weapons. It has given no indication that they have a reason to search her. One by one, an officer would come out and give a citation to the parent and then let one kid go. David Hickey is Natalie's father. He didn't know that the city had changed its curfew to 9 p.m., but has since researched the exceptions. More specifically, Section 50-237, which reads, when any person under 18 years of age is returning directly home from school activity, entertainment, recreational activities, or dance, David believes the girls didn't violate curfew. The, the law wasn't enforced right. They were there waiting for their parents. To me, that qualifies as returning directly home. Both parents received citations to appear in court on August 16th at 9 a.m. They could face a $500 fine for allowing their daughters to watch a 740 showing of Monster University. Now, I contacted Highland Properties, Cinemark, Security, and KCPD. I talked with someone at each agency. They all said they could not make anyone available for comment today. We'll be sure to follow up tomorrow. Lisa Benson, 41 Action News. Lisa, thank you.